previously on Macro Monday. In this episode, we're going to do things a little different. I'm going to get my daughter to actually go out and find me a subject. Jessica is back. What do we have? A caterpillar. Okay, so we have found a caterpillar. Right, I'm going to have to go outside and grab myself some green foliage. I touch it with the skin. He's actually coming straight out. I think nature is on my side this week. Put this on. Oh no, man. Oh no, it's all falling apart. Currently, the score stands at one all. Let's mix things up. In this episode, we're taking it outside. Welcome to Macro Monday. This episode of Macro Monday is sponsored by my macro presets for Adobe Lightroom. Whether you're looking for a one-click solution or a starting point, these presets are perfect for your macro photography. Check them out in the link in the description or go to stuartwood.com. So in this episode of Macro Monday, we have come outdoors to do a shoot. Now you know the rules of Macro Monday, they're very simple. I have 10 minutes to set the camera up, set the scene up, and get a social media worthy shot of an insect or whether subject I'm photographing all within those 10 minutes. But this one is gonna be slightly different. Because we already have a scene picked out, which is this flower down here, that means that we haven't got to set the scene up. So this time round, I'm going to take three minutes off the clock. That means we have seven minutes to get a social media worthy shot of whatever insects land on this plant. let's get started with seven minutes to get a social media worthy shot. So I'm going to start by undoing my bag and setting up the camera. So I have my ESR with the lower 100mm macro lens and because it's nice and bright and sunny I'm going to be able to get away with not using a flash. So I need to format my card from the last episode because I don't want those images getting mixed up. Let's take a quick shot. I'm going to start with 7.1 and one two hundredth of a second at ISO 100. All right, let's just get a shot and see what we got. Seriously? Oh no, I was doing the, uh, the video on um, the water drops. I turned off the, um, yeah, I turned off my EVA, EVF I mean. So I've got to quickly turn that back on. Uh, ooh. So because it's so bright out here, I'm going to be able to get away with not using my twin macro flash. That's going to save me some time setting up. Let's get a test shot and see what we got. You twat. I've got the timer on. Right, <laughs> let's turn that off. Um, quickly turn that off. And because I'm using mirrorless, I can easily see my exposure in the EVF instead of having to keep taking shots and then chimping. So because we are all set up for that now, what I can do now is turn on my high speed continuous shooting that will increase my chances of getting a shot. Now we just got to wait for a subject to come and land on our flower. So we got one. Let's have a look. And as usual, the insect's got this bum to me. No, I don't want a photograph of your bum. Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. I don't want to touch the flower. I think that's cheating, okay? So we want, to, we want this bug just to turn around. I could just get a side on view here. Right, 
and it is very dark in the background so I don't want that shot and it's gone we're risking losing this uh, this uh, episode I think let's increase our ISO I want to expose more for the background so it's not just the dark I want to get some color in there so now we are just literally waiting for a subject to come back and land on our flower so I can win this episode and go ahead to one. So if I wasn't filming, I could play Candy Crush while I was waiting. Sandal, oh, it's all right. See, he's got this bump to me again. Okay, so I think I need to increase my shutter speed slightly because we're a bit, a bit underexposed. So I'm going to bump my ISO to 800. Never be scared of putting your ISO up. But unfortunately, the background is just too dark. So what we can do here, I can't do nothing about the background because it's a lake. So Jessica, if you can come forward. So I have my daughter here who's uh, working the second camera. She's got the same colour top on as the flower. So I'm going to place her in the background to give a little bit of colour. And that's it, we've got a shot. Whew. A thingy, yes, a little fly. Shall we carry on photographing it? Can you bring your hand forward, Alice, like that? Yeah. Just there, like that. That's it, like that. Keep your hand there. Move it up a bit. That's it, keep it there. So that is a social media worthy shot. It is now 2-1 to me. I'm kicking nature's ass. But for now, I'm going to leave it there and I will see you on the next episode of Macro Monday. On the next episode of Macro Monday. Oh, he's going nuts inside there, he is. Back on, there you go. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, no, I'm off the stick. Just, whoa, whoa. Oh, he moved. You son of a bitch. Man, he's fast. You know what? Shit, I come here. No, you don't. If he does come back in, I'm going to stamp on him and create a Jackson Pollock macro shot. Well, that's it from this episode of... <sighs> it's so hard to work with kids. that's it I score another point it's 2-1 to me nature is fuck off Jesus Christ Come back where you are.